So you have a T TLC, Roku TV, and you have sound issues or audio issues or, or volume issues. Basically, your sound is not working at all. There's no sound. Or maybe it's intermittent. Sometimes you get sound, sometimes you don't. Or maybe there's a delay. Or maybe it's echoing, okay? Anyways, by the end of this video, 90% of you guys are going to be up and running, okay? So first and foremost is this step right here. What we're going to do is we're going to reset the TV or basically restart it using the remote okay how you do that it's a special key combination follow along ready so it's going to be you have to press the home button up here five times one two three four five and then up once and then rewind twice one two and then um, fast forward twice one two okay we'll do it together ready home button five times one two three four five up rewind twice fast forward twice and then let's see, now you can see the uh, TV is acting all funny. It's gonna stay like this for a little bit and it's gonna go ahead and uh, basically turn black, turn back on. This whole process takes like maybe 45 seconds, okay? So once it boots back up, it's gonna stay on the uh, TLC page for a little bit and then eventually it's gonna boot up, okay? Anyways, I'll go ahead and let this run, okay? And then, I mean, once it's booted back up, see if your sound is working. Most of you guys will be up and running with the sound, okay? TV just turned off. It's going to go ahead and uh, turn back on. So it's still reboot reboot process. Now, just really quickly, if after it boots back up and the sound is not working, the second step that you can try is wherever your TV is plugged in, with the TV on, what I want you to do is just go ahead and pull the power plug, wait 30 seconds, then plug it back in, then turn your TV on, and then see if this sound issue is resolved. If not, then we're gonna to go to the next step here. Okay, so if it's still not working, next thing we're gonna to try to do is just do a system software update. Just go ahead into your home, and then you wanna go down to settings, and then you wanna to move to the right. Then we wanna go down to where it says system. Oops, sorry. Actually, we wanna, ah, uh, sorry. Actually, it is system. So go to system, and then move over to the right. And now we want to do is we want to go down to where it says system update right there and then go ahead and see if you have an update. If you do, then download it, install it, and then see if you have sound after that. If you still don't have sound, then we're going to go to the next step here. So if you're still down after doing a system update, if you had one, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go and we're going to reset only the audio and picture settings. Okay, so go down to advanced um, system settings under the um, system here. We're going to move over to the right where it says factory reset. And then you want to move over to the right one more. Now you can see right here, it says reset TV audio and picture settings. Okay, so if you want to proceed, go to your remote and it says right there, press the play, pause button three times, one, two, three, and it'll automatically redo it. Once that's done, see if your sound is working. If it's still not working, then the last option I have for you is right here where it's a fact, it says factory reset everything. Okay, basically that will... Uh, make uh, do a factory reset back to original default settings as if you just bought this TLC TV brand new and took it out of the box, but you will have to put in your you know uh, your Wi-Fi credentials, Wi-Fi password. You got to sign in and uh, put your passwords in for Netflix, Amazon Video, Hulu, Sling, whatever you use. Anyway, ninety percent of you guys should be up and running now. Okay, the thing is, if you guys are still down, I would try every single step again. All right, let me know what step worked for you guys. Good luck. Remember, work, thumbs up. Didn't work, thumbs down.